Hey YouTube, um, so I, I don't have really updates or anything, but uh, the most amazing thing happened two nights ago. We slept through the night. It was 11 to like 8, which is awesome. Um, I woke up though, because the TV was on in the other room still. Um, and I changed his diaper while he was asleep. It was really quiet. It was awesome. No? And last night he did wake up for just like 10 minutes. He needed his diaper changed, and, I'm, and I fed him for like five minutes, and he was out again, so... Maybe this is gonna be all the time. I'm so excited. It's, it's refreshing. Uh, I feel good. Uh, so, and he's taking... His, his sleep schedule is so different all of a sudden. Um, he's eating a lot, a lot, and then he'll take a really long nap. I usually his naps like 45 minutes to an hour and I'll wake up and eat and be up for a little bit and then take another nap. But he's like eating a lot and taking like two to three hour naps and then waking up, eating and like playing, you know, with me and um, he'll stay up for like two hours and sleep for two hours. Awesome. I got so much to run. Thank God I found my Moby Rat the other day because he doesn't like to be put down. I don't really like putting, I like holding him all the time. But um with the Moby Wrap because it's just easier to walk around with uh, and get things done and I couldn't find it for the longest time I misplaced it and um he's I don't know he has like this thing like he falls asleep in my arms he'll sleep but if I sit him down I gotta be like uber quiet because he wakes up so easy um so yeah he is Lots of fun. I don't remember if I mentioned this in my last video or not. I don't think so. Me and him were in the bathtub the other night. Maybe I did. Um, and I think, I thought he was like just farting. I was like, oh, you got the teeth. And I'm like, I'm washing them. And um, all of a sudden the water starts changing color. And I'm like, hey, I need your help, please. <laughs> um, we got out of there fast. Poopy water. Um, but Oh, oh, I'm making this book for him. It's like Winnie the Pooh or something. It's like the first year of his life. You have like little pictures in it. And every mom's like, what's new with him? Um, he's getting really good at holding his own head up. Um, and it's just cute. Cause so like, I put him on the, you know, those bobbies. Those little sea nursing pillows. And I put him, like, his arms over it. And he'll be like... Like his head bobbles and then falls. Like when it gets too heavy, it's funny. Um, yeah, so that's pretty exciting. A couple of new exciting things have happened. Um, we have food. We're running out soon. He's been really good. He's such a good baby. I'm, I'm just happy to have a good baby. But um, he's eating right now. I love these bottles. They're awesome. He's still hungry, but I'm just going to show you him real quick. I just feel like every day, every day, it gets bigger and bigger. This is him. We're listening to some classical music. <laughs> Danya, can you see yourself? I don't think he's even better than that. No. But this is his thigh. Oh, it's getting so big. And this is me after, I don't know, two and a half months of having him. This is what I look like from the side. And I guess I'm, I'm right back to where I was. Uh, and my line's kind of fading. So, that's pretty cool. Um, oh my gosh, another cool thing happened. Um, nursing. He's latching on by himself. Um, um, and he like gets it, so I don't, sometimes he's in a bush shield just because he gets so frustrated sometimes when he's like really tired, but during the day, we don't use it at all, um, so that's pretty exciting. So, yeah, and then, when, like, we're leaving the 19th, we're going to New York, uh, for Thanksgiving, so that's going to be our first long trip, which I'm really excited about, and, um, yeah, we're just getting ready for that, and uh, we'll be out of here. We're going to be gone for uh, like a week and a half. She's just looking all around, the doors are open, so it's like, looking outside. 
loves outside so much. Um, he can be crying for anything as soon as we get outside. It's so funny, the car will be, the car will be going, and if it stops, he'll start crying, and then it goes again, he's quiet. And then it stops, and it stops, and he's like, start crying, I'm like, oh, go, just go. <laughs> but, um, yeah. So that's a friend. I love being with him. And the only times I have been without him is when I had to go to the hospital. Um, and I'm going to a candlelight Halloween party tomorrow night. And I told Jose, I was like, yeah, I'm going to go. It's at 6.30. He was like, okay. And he thought I was leaving him with his, with him. And I was like, no, not yet. He's like, you can though. And I was like, I know. And um, last night we took a bath. And I said, I need to take a shower. He said, can he just, you know, put his eyebrow on and get his jammies on. And I was like, can I have your help? And I was like, and you want me to leave him with you? You, what is that? No. <laughs> I thought that was funny. Um, okay, so I guess that's it for now. That was a little update. And, um, I will be back soon enough. He doesn't have another doctor's appointment until December. Which actually has two appointments. He has a doctor's appointment, and he also has uh, his follow-up with the hospital. Um, because he's premature, they do, you know, they make sure he's on track of growth, not like his body growth, like developmentally and physically. Maybe this is like, like, you know, his holding his head up and smiling and how he moves and. Stuff like that, so I'm pretty excited about that. That's on the 21st of December. Yeah, I'll make it close to Christmas. It's fun. Uh, yeah, so that's about it. Sorry about that. Uh, I will see you all next time. Thanks for watching and for subscribing. And